written by Murphy, here with another book review. <clears throat> I'm reviewing Art and Fear by David Bales and Ted Orland. It was published in 2012. It's a short book and it's really good. It's talking about the what it is like musings just kind of discussing what it is to be an what it is to be an artist what it is to create art it talks about how it's hard it's scary fear comes with when you're making art it's it's true and it doesn't even have to be that long it's not that long it's a really powerful discussion <clears throat> as I'm sitting here thinking about it I'm thinking about how <clears throat> they're saying this is how artists um, artists make their money by selling their art right mm, or they make money by teaching their art and when people get busy being a teacher, being a professor, they often stop making art. Hmm. This is a magical quote from the book. I don't remember who they were quoting. But uh, a man is asked by his little daughter, what do you do for work, daddy? And he says, he's a, he's a professor of art and he teaches at a college. And he says, I teach people how to draw. In little words for his little daughter to understand. And she says, do you mean they forget? Exactly. Apparently we do forget how to go about our world being fearless and creating art creating excellent art mm. Mm -mm. who gets to, to decide what's excellent the creator gets to decide that it is worth it deserves to exist by causing it to exist and they talk about how students will create art and they'll have shows and then those students will become teachers and the teachers stop. It will creep up that art death. <laughs> really good book but um, tough. It's tough. It's a challenge to stay creating. And of course, I'm very somber after reading it, thinking, mmm, it's not for the faint hearted. And that's what I got, got out of it. That's my book review. Definitely go check it out.